What's up guys, Boyke Cuddy, and I'm going to be showing you how to get the red and blue key cards so that you can make your way onto the next chapter in Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. Okay, so you're going to end up in the kids' room here just like this, and you're going to find a lamp on the table. Just inspect it, and if you look at it from beneath, you will see a red button. Press on the red button, and down will come a ladder from the attic. Head up the ladder, and in this attic, you are going to find a pedestal with already a wooden statue on it. Now, you know what to do because you've already done this a couple times. You're just going to turn it until it mimics the picture, and once the shadow matches the picture, you are going to just press on it, and it will open a trap door on the dollhouse to the right where you will find the blue key card. Run over and grab the blue key card. Now that you have the blue key card, we only need the red one, so just head down to the main hall and observe the clock in the main hall. On the clock, it will tell you a time. Mine is 10.15. You are going to head up the stairs into the room, into Grandma's room, or sorry, the master bedroom, and you are going to find a clock on the side of the table. Make it 10.15 as well, and then the trap door will open under the bed. Head down and then it will bring you into the workshop, a room that you are unable to get into through the door. On the table in the middle you will find the red key card. Grab it and head outside to the yard. Now you have the blue and the red key cards. You can throw them both into this door and voila. It will open up and you can move on and progress into the next chapter of Resident Evil 7. I hope this helped you guys out. If it did, comment, like, subscribe. For now, I'm Kid Cuddy and I'm out. Peace.